All right, today we're going to break down Oregon quarterback Justin Herbert. He was our top quarterback for the 2019 draft heading into this season, and nothing's really changed since then. He started off the season, weeks one through six, he's our top graded passer, played really well throughout those first six weeks. After that, it was a little bit up and down. We saw some struggles against pressure and things like that, but we're going to take a look at some of the positives, some of the things that he does well. And, and the biggest thing that sticks out is his big time throws down the field, especially up the seams. We've got three clips dialed up here for you to see his arm velocity and his talent to get down the seams on some of these throws. He's ultimately just going to take this cover two bender by the slot right down the seam. And he had a lot of drops this season. Let's go ahead and run the clip. He had the most drops on 20 plus throws out of any quarterback in college football. But we see the arm talent, the ability to just drive that with easy velocity right down the seam. Let's go ahead and go to that next clip here. Here we've got a fourth and 14 situation. This is week one of the season against Bowling Green where he just diced him up up the seam. We saw the first one that got dropped. Here's another great one here. Let's go ahead and run this clip. It's going to be basically the same play. He's trying to get down the field versus cover two in the middle of the seam. And this is one of the best throws we saw in college football all season long. But you're going to see him use his eyes, looks off the safety left, comes back to it, and drops in an absolute perfect shot. Defender has no idea that that ball is coming right behind his head. So some of these seam throws have been incredible. Let's take a look at the next one against Stanford. This was kind of his coming out game. He had a big game. We're going to get a motion out here, and then we're going to see him diagnose after the snap. The, the car, Stanford's going to roll down to a single high look from a two high shell, and they're going to have a switch release vertical that he's ultimately going to hit versus single high. Let's go ahead and run this, see exactly what's going on. We see the safety move. He's calm in the pocket, a lot of poise and delivers another strike up the seam this time versus single high. We got another back shot of this that gives an idea of exactly what he's looking at. So he sees number three roll down and he knows it's on up the seam from there. Delivers a great shot, best seam thrower in college football. It's been all season long. So the 20 plus throws are very special. Let's take a look at another aspect of his game that needs a little bit of work. One area of his game where we want to see him play a little bit better is outside the structure of the offense. Scramble plays throughout the season just did not show up very much. Very athletic guy to get outside on the move and make some of those plays, but they just didn't show up very much. But we are going to look at one of the plays where it did against Washington. We've got 21 seconds left in the half, a third and seven. This is going to be all him making a play outside, using his athleticism. We see the top of the drop. He's got some pressure. He squares, sets his feet, and fires a laser on the sideline in tight coverage and in a spot that only his receiver can make a, make a catch. He makes a great toe tap on the sideline. So more of those plays from Justin Herbert will elevate his game down the line. He's got it in him. Just needs to happen more often. But that's all we got today on Justin Herbert. He's had a solid season. Definitely an intriguing guy for the 2019 draft class if he chooses to come out. For more content, check out the rest of our YouTube channel.